I'm the chief architect of IHES and I'm also the group director of the architecture and innovation uh, division in IHES. Concurrently, I also hold a uh, portfolio in Ministry of Health Holdings as the director for the National Architecture Office. So IHES, our mission is to be the trusted IT uh, technology partner for our public healthcare clusters. Back in 2008, when IHES was first formed, uh, our, my first challenge was really I have architects coming from various IT departments that we just so-called consolidate them into under my team. So my first challenge was really how can we all speak the common language, achieve the same understanding of what enterprise architecture is all about. So that's where we engage uh, IHSS to help us uh, to establish a form of a common language as well as establish a reference model and foundation for our enterprise architecture team. And that allow us to make use of that framework uh, and uh, springboard us into the next few subsequent uh, enterprise architecture blueprinting exercise that we perform for our healthcare clusters. So the journey we have embarked on since 2008 really after establishing the framework and the foundation for uh, our architect with ISS, we actually went on to perform uh, an EA planning exercise for Jurong Health which is going to be the next new uh, hospital that's going to be open in, uh, at, in Jurong. The more recent one will be the one that we have done at the national level uh, to establish a uh, healthcare IT master plan for the entire public healthcare sector for the ministry. Uh, so that one was a very fulfilling and uh, very enriching uh, experience for our entire EA team. I'm glad to say that we have, uh, in two years running, uh, won an international award called ICMG Enterprise Architecture Award for two of the projects that we have done for the clusters. Uh, one was for the Jurong Health Project and the other one was for the EHA Integrated Care Project. IHS Consulting Services is special in the sense that we develop the EA project jointly with the customer but at the same time, we also focus on helping them to develop their architecture capability, transferring knowledge and skills to them so that when we leave the project, the customer can continue the EA journey on their own. This is a four-phase project over 18 months. So for the first phase, we conducted a five-day training for all the staff involved in the project so that everyone is on the same page and understand what is EA, right? So for the second phase, we actually um, developed six months reference models um, development. And the third phase is actually a co-development of a methodology and architecture framework tailored to the healthcare sector. And for the fourth phase, we actually um, use the methodology and the framework to develop a segment architecture on chronic disease management.